So we called the vet and they said we should bring him in, but they don't have an appointment till noon. So we're just going to take a little easy hike with the pups and, and kind of get them outside and a little exercise. And then we're going to bring Rasko into the vet and we're going to make the little boy feel all better. And yeah, then we're going to go from there. Take me back all the way back to the day. Running around in a gown and a crown, barefoot. No mistake ever kept me late. We spent summers catching fireflies and winters on our skates. One big smile across my face We used to dance our way to church on Sundays Mama set the pace Daydream of and May Alright, so we're just finishing up this hike and we're gonna head back because it's almost time for us to head to his appointment. It's around that time, but it's a really beautiful hike. It's right by the water right here, which is great. Beautiful views of the mountains, which is always amazing. And it's just a lot of nice shady spots. So it's a really nice little hike. We just chose a little easy one today because a little sco. But he's doing better. He hasn't been gaggy or anything. And he's been adventurous as ever, of course. So I'm sure he'll be absolutely fine. <laughs> doctors are probably not gonna let Cody back but he'll probably text me and let me know but yeah we just didn't want to take any risks so little Maxwell and I are just chilling in the car waiting for our boy so we'll let you know how he does <laughs> was feeling a little better i think today we gave him some soft wet food yesterday that the doctor recommended and he hasn't thrown it up yet i guess his liver enzymes are really high so it can be really scary or it could be nothing she said so it's just a little 
alarming, but he is keeping it down. He's just been a little fragile the last, um, last couple days, but definitely becoming less fragile as the day goes on. So that's good. It's just nerve wracking, but I'm sure he'll be fine. Cody's very confident that he'll be fine because he has such a strong tummy. Such a strong tummy. Pretty cool boy. <laughs> Maxwell. He hasn't been enjoying that Roscoe's been getting all out of the attention, but what are you gonna do? Right now we're just chilling, waiting for Cody to come back from the bathroom, probably take a little walk with the pups, take the day just as it comes. If he's feeling good, maybe we'll go for a hike or something. But it's a really lovely overcast today that's making it not hot out in this this morning, and it was even a little thunder and lightning. Oh, it's just so nice. It's so nice for it not to be just like blazing hot for once. <laughs> so grateful. <laughs> Kutanai Falls. We've just been checking it out. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous spot. But yeah, we're about to go check out the Kutanai Waterfalls and we went on the swinging bridge. It was really cool. But I'm pretty sure this is in Montana. It's not actually in Idaho. We're right on the border, so I'm pretty sure this is Montana. <laughs> There is absolutely none available, so oh well. I think I'm just gonna wait for my shift then. It's like almost two o'clock. I'll probably go in around four. I'm just gonna try to find the shady spot with the pups because this heat is just killing us. I woke up feeling so nauseous this morning because it was so hot in the tent. Oh my gosh. I am just so over this heat. It is so intense. Today is only 85 degrees and every other day has been like 95 and it's still so hot like it's just been brutal so i think we're just gonna go sit down by the shade and maybe get in the water a little bit but it's just yeah there's it's too hot to do anything else i really wanted to go take them to the state park but they're just getting too hot in the sun so i don't think it's gonna happen but hopefully it cools down it's not supposed to but hopefully an update on roscoe he is doing like completely fine now He's just like a normal dog again. <laughs> Cody said, yeah, give it a couple days. I'm sure he'll be back to normal. And he was right, totally fine. Just a couple days of wet food and he is uh, back on track. <laughs> <laughs>
What's up guys? Just got off work a little bit ago and just been hanging out with the puppies and enjoying our last night in Idaho. I'm so grateful that we were able to come to this spot and spend some time with Barry and get to hang out with him and all of his friends. We got to work at a restaurant and bartend and make some money and how awesome. It's just like super, super grateful. And when we weren't working, we got to enjoy this amazing lake. Super grateful for all, to all the people at the restaurant. You guys have made us feel so welcome and like family and it was just such a fun week working with you guys. So, so so grateful but yeah we'll definitely be back we want to try to be camp hosts here at this campground next year so fingers crossed it can happen because this place is awesome so we'll see probably just gonna enjoy sitting by the lake one last time and packing up getting everything in order to go to montana tomorrow super exciting montana i don't know why i said montana i just listened to that and i was like what <laughs> montana if you're not sleeping tight you know we're on to something you hear the streets are crying our shantos in fighting All the way from north to south It's been a long time coming